Hi guys, sorry, I'm going to read Marvel Mystery Comics number 28. This is a Human Torch story. The The cover has like some guy, he looks like he's from the Ku Klux Klan or something. And he's like little golem looking things, but this isn't in the story at all. So it's kind of just clickbait. But Stark Terror was unleashed in the underground den of evil until the Human Torch blazed down. So again, that might have happened in this, the events of this might have happened in like the next issue or the issue before. Like I find old comics like often just click, like would just like bait people into buying them based on the covers and the, and the covers would be different from the stories. I find that the Human Torch and Toro, the flaming kid in the Poison Pill Suicides by Carl... Carl Burgos. That's pretty dark. The air was filled with merry laughter and the grounds teemed with costume revelers, for it was Mardi Gras, time in Coney Island. But death interrupted the festivities and brought to light the corrupted game of Eisen, whose henchmen preferred suicide to the gruesome death he dealt out to those who failed him. The Flame Masters knew there was something behind those suicides, but what? The police headquarters. You mean we are to lead the Coney Island Mardi Gras? That is, that's if you accept the offer. Yippee! What do you say, Torch? Sure, why not? It'll be fun, eh, Toro? The next day at Coney Island, a shrill whistle denotes the start of the pageant. Make way for the Flame Masters! And directly behind Torch and Toro, the Mardi Gras officials. What an attraction! Torch and Toro present! Attraction, you made a colossal spectacle. Gee, it feels great to lead the parade, Torch. You bet it does. Keep your flame away from those spectators, Toro. Suddenly, Torch, the official's car, it's blazing. That clown, he's ready to get to throw something. A bomb leaves the clown's hand as the torch wings into action. I've got to stop that bomb before somebody gets hurt. Caught it, a flame bomb. Just my meat, my meat. Now for that clown, Blam. The torch whirls in midair and starts for the clown. This one is mine, Torch. Gotcha, funny man. Oop. Toro, he's putting something in his mouth. Stop him. Ha, you'll never get me. Uh. Huh? He's dead. He must have swallowed a poison pill. Let's get back to the wreck. Nasty work, Torch. Mr. Martin's the only one alive from that wreck. Wait, he's trying to say something. What is it, Mr. Martin? Torch, watch out. Smugglers in the tower. Oh, he's done for. Wonder what he meant. It makes no sense. In the next day in the police commissioner's office, that clown's suicide has me puzzled, and I'm puzzled about the Martin, Martin gasping about the tower and the smugglers before he died. Why don't you two go down to the island and see what you can unearth? That's a good suggestion. Let's go, Toro. So long, Kamish. We're off to the amusements. A Coney Island. A tower. That's what we have to look for, Toro. And there it is. A parachute jump. Wow, what a leap. Hmm, we're going up for a ride, Toro. As they near the top. I feel like a stratosphere flyer. Say, that cabin alongside of us doesn't descend like the others. And a man inside scanning the water with field glasses. Look, Toro! A boat loaded with boxes just pulled out of a secret cove. So what? Just this. Torch, we're shooting down without a parachute. Torch and Toro blaze their way out of the cabin. You go after the operator, I'll get the one in the tower. Okay, hotshot. As the torch nears at the top, a figure hurtles past him. What in? Ha ha, death is my only way out. Blast it, a second suicide, bud. Too bad. Toro, did you get the operator? No, this bird claims to be the ticket t t collector. There's an operator running into the crowd. Let's get him. Better put out our flames or we might hurt someone. He ducked in here. So we'll duck in here too. Quick, through the barrel. right -o. Oops, I lost my balance. Hey, get off of me, Torch. The Torch crawls out of the barrel. Hey, you shrimp, I'm no horse. What do you think I was before, a cushion? 
Oh, it feels like I went through the mill. No time for complaints. There goes our quarry. Ah, so there he is. I'll get him this time. No, Torch, don't. See, what you saw was only a reflection in the mirror. You're right. That guy must have gone the other way. As they start in opposite directions. Oops, another mirror. Ha, how does it feel to have a mirror pushed on your face, kid? Bam. Torch, look. A mirror moving back in place. It must lead to a secret passage. And I know where to find it. Torch starts walking backward along the line of the mirror's reflection and... Here it is, Toro. Let's go. Brr, this place reminds me of a tomb. Shh, voices coming from that door. But Aizen, I came here to warn you. Bah, you probably left the trail for the torch to follow. How did he guess? Inside. It would have been easier to commit suicide. Suicide is better than the treatment. Grab him, men. You failed me. No, Aizen, no. But this little device won't. Remember, men. Better use the pill than force me to use this. Globar! The warning light. Someone's out in the outside chamber. I'll fix that. Suddenly outside. The door's closed. Let's burn through. Slam. What the? These walls must have been made of asbestos. They don't melt. Torch the door at the entrance also closed. We're trapped. While well, inside the other room. One way to take care of fire is to use plenty of water. Torch in that miniature incinerary bomb will have plenty. Water pouring in through jets in the floor. Toro, quick, start blazing over the water. I don't get it, but here goes. With their bodies blazing hot, Torch and Toro wing low over the rising water. Hey, Torch, water's starting to boil. Exactly. The water isn't pouring in anymore. Under the flame, Master's blaze, the water soon turns to boiling steam. There, it worked. The steam forced the water back through the pipes. Well, I'll be, I'll be a cigar lighter. The torch suddenly lets loose a blanket of flame over the floor. What's that for, torch? I want to melt the water jet so that no one else will be trapped. Suddenly, what's that? The steam pressure forced open the door to Aizen's hideout. Rip. Empty. Save the victim of Aizen's special treatment. No wonder his men preferred suicide than be drowned in that glass bowl. Hmm, what's this? Smashed radio apparatus and burnt records. Uh, Aizen is smart. Some of the records didn't burn. Ooh, so that's his game. Hey, Torch, here's a love letter with daggers for you. Let's have a look at it, Torch. Watch out, Torch. Even you can be burned playing with fire. Aizen. What's behind all this, Torch? These records prove Aizen has been smuggling arms to South America. These half-burned slips are receipts of delivery. Say, we're being gassed! My f being gassed my foot. We are gassed. I'm getting weak. Take it easy, Toro. Suddenly, the chamber is filled with armed men wearing gas masks. Surprised to see us back, eh? You murdering rat. Don't insult the poor rat's torch. Summoning all the, the strength, Torch hurls a fireball. Try murdering this... Wh what the? Ha, you're so weak you can fling a fireball. Soon the gas will have its full effect. Man in masks throw heat much hot air. Me feel worse. Uh, Hold on, Curly Lock. You big chunk of meat all slap. Shut up, rat. So it made them stupid, I, th I think. Quiet, I'll give you a chance to get mad in those. Glass coffins. Uh, we ain't dead yet? But weakened by the glass, they were made easily, easily made prisoners. Chains removed, they are forced into the glass coffins. Filled with gas, which extinguishes flame but permits breathing. Ah, my two helpless charges. Wheel them out. What a pickle. Hundreds of boxes and guns and ammunition. And I can't do anything to stop its delivery. Easy, men. Those two are available cargo. Guess we, guess we can take off these masks now and wait for nightfall. Uh, I think I think that says nightfall. I think that says fall. I don't, I don't know what that says. 
But open the secret exit. We're shoving off later in the open sea. Do you hear me, Torch? This is far as you go, both go. From now on, you're going to play tag with the fishes. Nuts. Dump them overboard. Torch first. Yes, sir. It'll. I'll be all over once I hit the water. Can't let Toro down. Let's find a way out. Say, my flinger, finger's blazing. There must be an air leak in this tube. That's my way out. Torch presses his finger against the glass till it burns white hot as the men give a, the coffin a final shove. That's it. The white hot glass splits as it makes contact with the cold water. The torch is free. How in? Get the machine guns. Now it's my turn. Torch moves high into the dark night and writes a blazing message. SOS. Hope the Coast Guard sees that. Uh-oh. Eisen's heaving Toro overboard. A couple of fireballs ought to do the trick. Toro's free. Hi, hi, tough guy. Look like you need a shave. Yo! They're turning the machine guns on us. I'll take care of that rib tickler. You're getting bald and need a hot scalp massage. There. Blunk. On the lower deck. Another move and you boys get the flaming mud pack. Suddenly the melee stops. Surrender, Torch. I will be all blown to high heaven. Ha, you're a chump. I hold all the aces. Torch whips up a huge fireball. Now put down that gun or you'll be shaking hands with this fireball. Suddenly a light beam plays on the torch and Eisen. Heave to for boarding. It's the Coast Guard, Eisen. Your game's up. Trot that gun. Coast Guard, eh? Eisen loses his nerve. Here, take it. Hey. So long, hot pants. That's what you think. A winding fireball catches Eisen in midair. I'm burning. No, you're not. Just a hot singe sucker. Eisen hits the water with a sizzling splash. The flame's heating the water. Glob, glob, I give up, Torch. We got him, Torch. Is everything under control in your ship? Yes, sure thing. Torch forces, forces Eisen's men to board the Coast Guard boat. Okay, boys, step lively. You're headed for the last roundup. Uh, suddenly. Torch, they're taking the pills. What? Ah, ah, we die. Eisen, you promised us to follow us. You must. Oh, no, no. I don't want to die. Ha, ah, they did as I ordered to them too. But I'm yellow. I want to live. I'll tell everything. Yes, I built a parachute jump and put a lookout there to see if the Coast Guard wasn't around. And they smuggled arms to a ship outside the harbor. But why was Martin killed? He found out what my game was, so I eliminated him. That was dumb. <laughs> your bombing put, put us on your trail. Torch and Toro leave Eisen with the Coast Guard and soar into the night. Torch, or Toro, how about spending the rest of the night at Coney Island? Huh? No, sir. I hear the Sandman calling. I'm hitting the hay. Another complete Human Torch story in Marvel Comics next month. So that's the end of that story. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this video. If you could like, comment, and subscribe, that'd be appreciated. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.